engineer back a question and uh, I have a question related to the topic that you spoke about. Uh, you brought up uh, a very good point about the media that media can break up big. Um, one of the things that the media can do um, is if it spreads uh, negative uh, propaganda. And the second part of the dynamic is that how it's perceived. So my question is that what would be one of the key things that Muslims, when they are exposed to such negative media, how they should react uh, to antagonism and things of that sort? Well, uh, the question that does agree must be that media can make and break. How should the Muslims react? As far as reaction to the media is concerned, the media today will be more damaged for the human beings than good. Media is more damaged. Even for the Muslims. Even for the Muslims, even for the Muslims, they are so hooked on to the media and more of the entertainment and the haram media rather than the good media. It's causing more damage. And, as I rightly said, it can convert day into night, black into white, hero into villain, villain into hero. And for a layman, it's difficult to decipher. And one such example is just a few months back. Though I avoid coming on talk shows, I come on talk show in the Indian media on NDT. On the panel was Shah Rukh Khan, Karan Johar, and some other personalities, including myself. And you all know a policy that I will come along with my camera. And Baraka Das was the anchor, so you may have heard of her. But she is very popular in the anchor. So we are a condition that if you allow a camera, we come other than you. She agreed. The manager agreed. Last one they said, sorry. Anyhow, the reply that I gave her editor. It made me say things that I did not say. This is how the media, for example, when he came to me. And if you ask me, that what is your view regarding George Bush? So if the George Bush is not good, I will chop off the knot and make you hear George Bush is good. And when I show you your interview, you will think it's a slip of the tongue. You won't realize how I've done it. What do you say? No, brother, that it was a slip of the tongue. I said George Bush is good. Actually, what I wanted to say was George Bush was not good. Actually, you said George Bush was not good. But I edit your answer in such a way, it seems you have said, George Bush is good. So this is the media. So this is what they did and that what we did, we had a counter show on PC. We had a show called TV Talk and NS. And then we post that how a person can play with the media and how Muslims should be careful with the media. That what you see on the television with your eyes and what you hear with your ears may not always be the fact. Therefore, the intention and the integrity and the honesty of the host and the producer is very important. If the intention, the honesty, the integrity of the host who is taking the interview or the producer is in doubt, he can exactly convey the opposite message on the person is coming. Therefore, what you see on news channels is not always correct. Therefore, on my personal view, this is my personal view, people may differ. I consider the news channel to be more bad for the Muslims than even the Haram entertainment channel. You know why? In the Haram entertainment channel, you are doing one thing. It is wrong. I am not in favor. But the news channel is attacking your Iman. It is leading you to work off. So according to me, it is my opinion, I may be wrong. According to me, I believe that a news channel is more dangerous for a Muslim even than a pornographic channel. That doesn't mean you should watch pornographic channel. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> My analysis. Pornographic channel, because you know it is haram. Like how I say that dripa is more bad than having drugs. How? It is so bad. Why? Because in the Quran, in talks of it is haram. Dripa? Besides being haram, Allah and the school will wage a war against you. So when they say this, they understand how haram is dripa. Similarly, when I say pornography channel, every Muslim agrees. It's haram. Why? 
उसको कोरोना वायरस की जानी था बट द न्यूज चैनल इज अटैकिंग योर ईमान इज लिविंग यू टू वर्ड इट्स मोर डेंजरस मोर हार्मफुल अपन टू मी बिकॉज वेन दे पोर्ट्रेट द न्यूज दे डू इट विथ सो मच सोफेस्टिकेशन दैट यू टेन टू बिलीव इन दैट सो मी बींग अ मैन ऑफ द मीडिया इट फॉर मी डिफिकल्ट टू डिस्कवर Being a man of the media, knowing in and out about anything, that's my field, that's my specialty. So they can play have off with it. So that's the reason you cannot always believe what you see, and you cannot believe what you hear. Therefore, the Quran says in Surah Al-Jurat, chapter fourteen, verse number six: Whenever you get information, you check it up before you pass it on to the third person. Hope that's the question. And I think you're getting ready to allow one last question before we end the session.